Oh, hi, AJ. You know what? You were completely right. I forgot about the word poppycock, and that is literally the worst thing I could have ever done. <laughs> did you see what I did there? Yeah, uh, uh. I used a word that you talked about last week, and I put it in my week, and I didn't use it properly, and all those other things. But whatever! You know what? Words! And new words, to be exact. Did you know that the Oxford English Dictionary, among other dictionaries, are constantly adding new words to their pages? Well, they are. Uh, and that means that a lot of internet slang and other verbal monstrosities are now legitimate Scrabble words. That's why this week I'm giving 11 new dictionary words that are in there because of the internet. And I'm also going to add the Scrabble scores to the bottom just because, you know what, I take a little bit of joy seeing them. A little warning to hardcore Scrabble enthusiasts, uh, a lot of these words would be considered contractions, but because they've been used so often, they're now their own independent words, so you can go suck it. Starting at the bottom with five points, we have deets, which is of course the lazy way of saying details. Next at seven points, we have guac, of course short for guacamole. At seven points, I can't believe this one actually is a word, radic, which is short for ridiculous which is exactly what it is to have this word in the dictionary. Also at eight points is probably my favorite word on this list, seriously, which is of course just vowels removed of seriously. Seriously, this is actually a word. Put an SPR in the beginning and it's super seriously. Here's one that I actually never knew existed until making this list. At 12 points, it's cruft. And cruft means badly designed, unnecessarily complicated or unwanted code or software. At 11, we have tweeps, which is persons following you on Twitter. Shout out to my tweeps. At 13 points, we have vacay, which is of course short for a vacation. And you're obviously taking a vacation from English if you decide to use that in front of me. Also at 13 points, we have tweetable, which is anything suitable for posting on social media Twitter, which apparently for a lot of 16-year-old girls is everything. Also at 13, but a fantastic Scrabble word, lulls, which is fun laughter of amusement, especially that derived at another person's expense. Sitting with 14 points, we've got phablet, which is a smartphone that has a screen which is in between the sizes of a regular smartphone and a tablet. Yes, we have come to that point in life where we need to distinguish that awkward middle ground in how rich and disposable I am with phones. And finally, with a monstrous 17 points, facepalm, which is of course a gesture in which the palm is placed against one's head as an expression of dismay, exasperation, or sheer embarrassment. Well, that's all the words I got for you today, AJ. You know what? Have yourself a fantastic week, and don't forget, I lulls tacos.